Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing a Target figure from Transformers Animated. These are some Target exclusives from Transformers Animated. And we got Sunstorm and Ratchet. Before we look at Ratchet and Sunstorm themselves, we're going to look at the old school packaging. Got some nice artwork of Sunstorm and Ratchet fighting one another. It's a versus pack. Why not? Huh. Ages 5 plus. And all that other information. Let's flick it around see the back of the box. Product shot of Sunstorm in his robot mode and Ratchet in his robot mode. Looking very nice. And you can flip the guns out. Give them some armaments below the jet, which is nice. That's all there is to say for the packaging. Let's get down to looking at the figures themselves. I've got the guns flip out like just on the packaging. See that? But you can also flip the guns upwards for storage. And he rolls. Very good. Same goes for Ratchet. But now, for comparison, here is the Earth Mode Pop and Change Ratchet next to Deluxe Class Cybertronian Mode Ratchet and Sunstorm next to Pop, Pop, Pop and Transform Starscream. That's all there is to say for those comparisons. Let's get down to transforming these cool figures. Shall we? Let's. We're going to start with Sunstorm, which I've figured out how to transform them. Flip down the landing gear. Disconnect from the legs. It's easy that you can pop this out easy. I, I tell you, the moment I messed around with it, you can easily pop this out with ease. It's a real pain in the neck how much things pop out on you. And I just dropped the missile. But yeah, it's a lot fussy with this old school figure and things like the pop out of the joints a lot. It is what it is for an old school figure. Why not? There I say, why not? Oh, come on, Sunstorm. Keep your leg attached. Because, man, his leg likes to detach a lot. Oh, and parts like to detach so many times on this figure. I've had my fuss with this figure since I got him. Yeah, and his missiles fire off, like, real easy from the triggers. For sure. And there's Sunstorm in his robot mode. Not a bad-looking robot mode, and that's... That clone Starscream head with the smirk is so cool. Especially for an old school Transformers animated figure. I love this figure. I don't like is the is the poppin' loose joints, but other than that, real good figure. He's got articulated fingers, which is nice. 
and a really good paint scheme. I definitely love this particular Starscream repaint. But yeah, this is Transformers Animated Sunstorm, and I just think he looks cool. But now for comparison with this Sunstorm, we're going to bring in some other Decepticons. My fill-in for Transformers Animated. My fill-in for Transformers Animated. Slipstream with the Cyberverse Slipstream. And, of course, my fill-in for Thundercracker, because he's Thundercracker. Why not? For Animated Thundercracker, we got a fill-in for that particular bot. And, of course, why not? My fill-in for Animated Skywarp, Robots in Disguise Skywarp, Fall Cybertron Skywarp, and Cybertron Skywarp. And, last but not least, the leader... Of the Seekers in Transformers Animated. I'm speaking about good old Starscream. One version of Starscream, which I still have. Which I have, so. I don't have any other Starscreams from the Transformers Animated, but. Here is Sunstorm next to good old Screamer. Why not? There I say, why not? And then we got the Seekers. So far, I am going to be getting a fill-in for Ramjet. But I've nearly gotten all six versions of the Animated Seekers of my own. Versions of the Animated Seekers. So this is a set that's coming along. I only need Ramjet to complete the Armada. And then I got the Seekers ready for battle. And now, the last figure we're going to transform here is Pop and Change Ratchet. Flip down his legs. Fold this down. And he pops and change and transforms. And there we got Animated Ratchet in his robot mode. Flip down his feet. And there we got Gr Ratchet. And he's big and chunky in the show he's big and chunky so he's like what are you looking at at can a bot take a stasis nap in peace <laughs> I couldn't help but imitate Ratchet's grumpness because in Transformers animated he is such a grumpy bot and I just love that about him but now we're gonna transform his other self to compare it to which is very simple I've done this so many times this transformation it's become a no-brainer for me so yeah a no-brainer for me so uh, give me some time to transform this figure and then I'll do the comparison which I need some time to transform this old figure. But I've memorized this one particularly. Okay. Straighten out his legs. And here we got this version of Animated Ratchet next to the Earth Mode Pop and Change figure. I don't have the regular Ratchet to compare this to, but I do have this version. And I'm so glad to have it. Would I recommend the Transformers Animated Sunstorm and Ratchet 2-pack if you like these particular Transformers? Yes. Transformers Animated was one of the best lines that came out. But before I end this video, I want to look, at, look up the year that Transformers Animated came out in. Just so I know for, for the video. What year did Transformers Animated come out in? Cartoon. It came out in 2007. Wow. These figures are from 2007. So man, that's pretty old. So yeah, I'm so glad to have these figures in my collection. 
And if you're a Transformers animated fan like I, like I watched it and I was a huge fan, pick these guys up. They are worth the money. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out, YouTube land.